Welcome to yet another 12pm tutorial. This tutorial will teach you how to use FreeGate, an anti-censorship tool produced by Dynamic Internet Technology. FreeGate is a standalone piece of software that connects you to the internet through DynaWeb, which uses a system of peer-to-peer -peer proxy connections in order to grant users access to information that has been blocked in their area. 12pm Tutorials has another video tutorial that focuses on DynaWeb that you can check out at bit.ly slash bhkwtp. Freegate is a simple piece of software that simply needs to be downloaded and ran in order to function. Put Freegate on a USB flash drive and you can take it with you and use it at any computer. Now that you know what Freegate is, let me show you how to use it. First, we need to download Freegate. So open up your web browser and go to www.dit-inc.us. If this is your first time on the DIT website, go ahead and take a look around before we continue. Once you're done looking around, click on the Our Products link on the left-hand side of the screen. Now click on the Freegate link. Go ahead and read the information if you would like, and then click download the latest Freegate client software. This page will give you some different download options. Click on Download Professional Edition and save it to your computer. Once the file finishes downloading, close your browser and go find your file. Go ahead and double click the icon now. What you see here is the user interface. The tabs here will present you with different information and options. The one you might want to take a look at first is Settings. I'm going to leave all these like they are, but feel free to set anything as you see fit. As a side note, you can go to the Settings tab and set the Freegate browser to close automatically when you exit the program. You can also set Freegate to automatically delete your browsing history when you close the program. I suggest using these two features for extra security. Now that we're connected, I'm going to go to the Internet Explorer browser that Freegate opened for me. This browser can be used safely to access websites and information that may be blocked where you are accessing the Internet from. In order to exit the Freegate program, click on the X or click Exit. Freegate should ask if you want to keep the Internet Explorer windows open or if you want to close them. I'm going to close them. Now you know how to use Freegate.